they've got to control the tempo of this ball game. Ben and Brown with the first shot of the game. Ben Gordon got the rebound. Now Emeka Okafor, the emphatic start to the season. Not just the size, the hands. And Okafor with his first of many blocks. Screen and Fring love it up. Now you mentioned earlier outside shooting. This is the area he's got to get better right there. He can score there, Okafor. Ben and Brown almost lost his footing. Shot would go for Tariq Brown, and it's jammed through by Okafor. <laughs> I saw a heel mark on the back of his jersey. Okafor rattles one home. They had three turnovers. They have seven for the game now. Okafor, a chance for the old-fashioned three-point play. Get it inside to the big guy, Jay. That's a good pass. But not a good shot by Brown. Kevin Brown. And the authoritative follow by Okafor. Malik Brown. Marcus Williams has come in, number five, and there's Okafor, the turnaround baseline jumper. He has 12 points to lead the Bulldogs. Okafor with 16, leading Connecticut, now has 18. Very nice. Wow. Gordon Okafor. Gordon had 13 against Yale. He has four tonight. Hill Thomas has it blocked, and there's the first one of the night for the big guy. Yesterday, he does not want to get caught up in the number one height. Okafor with the jump hook, and it goes for him. They were able to execute very nicely and get themselves some good shots. Ball working on Okafor, working hard, and it blocked away. Denim Brown from the foul line, that rolls off the rim, a battle for the board. Okafor stuffs it back in. To find their rules, Okafor, Josh Boone, they want to know what's happening with this team now rather than later. Outlet to Gordon, he lays it off. Okafor there for another stuff. Gordon on the drive, 19 first half points. Cold early here, but Okafor there to collect it and stuff it in. From Nevada, Williams fighting Okafor for an easy two. This is their biggest lead of the game. Bill Thomas blocked away by Okafor. Highly successful in both places. Okafor's turnaround is good, and UConn has its first lead. Sacred Heart is getting the ball to the paint a lot and not coming up with much because of the shot blocking and intimidation of Okafor. That is a long outlet pass when you get a rebound off a free throw miss. Oh, trailing the play, taking the feed and jamming it home is Okafor. Terrific shooting in the first half, the dump down inside. And Okafor muscles his way up and he's head up when he's dribbling the ball up the floor. He averaged as many assists last year as the point guard. Good job inside by Emeka. Just over four and a half minutes gone in the second half. Oh, that's a good feed from Williams, and he slams it in. And it was not his trip. It was the foul. He's going to get another one as Hooker jams that one home. It has not been determined when the new expansion will come with the new five teams. So you got 14, three leads. That gives you 11. You add five, there'll be 16 teams. And among those, Louisville and Cincinnati. There's a steal. Now watch this kid's eyes as he comes down here. Behind he sees the back, Okafor finishes oh. it off. That'll get him going. You gotta love that. You know, you knew that he was gonna give it a shot. And here his teammates, obviously very happy he's out there. And here's the reason why. A terrific player runs the floor extraordinarily well for a guy his size. But here's where he dominates on the block. And here another one on penetration does a great job. On pace to become the leading shot blocker in NCAA history. More bumping bodies. Swatted away by Okafor. One timeout, which I know he's saving for a critical time. Muhammad blocked by Okafor. Clean block. Once again, challenging him. Billy Brown gives off for Okafor. Muscling his way in for two. Virtually every time he had to run the length of the floor the other night, there were times he made monstrous dunks with spectacular blocks. He wriggles free for two here, but he's been stone cold since opening day. Okafor working on Frost, jumps into the paint for two. Until Brown pushes. Found Okafor, and he got it. And, of course, Okafor with that amazing shot-blocking ability, even if he doesn't touch it. He winds up harrying the shot. There's Okafor collecting. He'll go to the line. But for the most part, it's been that UConn D that's really stymied them. Bogut blocked by Okafor. Got it back. Muscles it up and missed it. Okafor low. A sweet turnaround. That was over Bogut, who had no way to defend him. Wednesday in the semis. Gordon lifting a three. 
Tipped off of Bruno before he stuffs it home. I'm sure Rick Majerus is going to make some adjustments as this team learns how to play. Well, they better make some adjustments to number 50 because he's tearing them up in the paint. And I know Rick Majerus is going to find a way to toughen them up. Well, good block by Okafor, his second. Yeah, everyone had already left for the holiday. Okafor free, got it. He can be that much more effective inside. Okafor ahead, and he slams it down with the right hand. To do it as well as he does on the court and in the classroom. But his will to succeed in both areas is incredible, and his teammates are blown away by it. Back inside Okafor. A, a national contender, national championship contender like U UConn against a team like Lehigh. From Brooklyn, the freshman. Fearless going down in there. Oh, nice. Oh. Set up and great execution on the finish by Okafor. Then Gordon back in. Talik Brown takes a seat. Oh, nice. Can't beat oh. that. Oh, oh. And Gabroff down low. Got six on the shot clock. Turned it over again without a shot. And as you see what they did to Texas Tech in the championship yeah. of the preseason and they took them apart as well. Yeah. Wasn't a fluke. Okafor with the bucket gives him 10. He'll go to the line. Rashad Anderson getting his first start of the season. Lob pass down low and Okafor picks up the loose chain. And here's Talik Brown. UConn up four with the ball. We've played two minutes. Okafor foul on jumper. He spins in the lane, and Okafor with his first block of the night. And in the lane, Doliak and Villanueva with his first career block. Okafor with his second block of the night. Big East opponents, they've had their way. They've also won 22 of their last 25 here. Okafor rejecting the Amadou shot. That's his third block of the night. Just got such great timing and ability inside. Villanueva misses the shot. Okafor with the rebound and putback. Notre Dame at home against Central Michigan. And... There's Okafor with his fourth block shot of the night. But Gordon couldn't finish. He was a little off balance. Two on one the other way. And Okafor got a piece of that one. Shot clock down to five. Down low, Amadou wants to go on Okafor. There's his sixth block of the night. Ooh, that was emphatic, too. He spent last year at Oak Hill Academy. Down low, Okafor is shot. Counted in the foul. Tate in the lane. Head fake. And Okafor with... Block number seven, 19 to shoot for Army. 14th rebound of the night. So that ties his season high. He had 14 against Nevada, and at the other end. Had to feel good to get that one to go down. Just his second field goal of the night. He's got five. Denim Brown, no good. Rebound, Okafor. There's a reason why they have erasers on pencils. And the official stat crew here at UConn has gone back and checked things and has determined that Okafor had one more block than we thought he had. So as it turns out, he has 10 blocks. Wow. And he has the first triple-double for a UConn player since Karan Butler did it on December 26, 2000 against Rhode Island. Gordon has it. Good look up ahead. Here's Brown. Trailing and jamming is Okafer. He goes inside. Okafer from the baseline. Drills it. The miss. The follow. No good. Tipped in by Okafer. He's got eight to lead the scoring early on. Well, here they come again. And Okafor gets inside, finishes the shot, finishes the break, and draws the foul. The coaching change coming at St. John's. And Mike Jarvis. And down low, it's Okafor to jam at home. Talik really not an offensive shooter from the outside. Teams generally give him the shot. Okafor uses the glass. This is Bruin. That's blocked by Okafor. Just to run along the line first. Oh, beautiful pass wow. inside. And here comes Talik Brown. He'll take wow. it in, scoops it up, misses the shot, tipped in, and counts. I love this standing up, Bob, until they score. Usually it doesn't have it. They sit down pretty quickly. He is their leading offensive player. Shoots 54% from three-point range, 53% for the, for the team overall. Okafor cleans up his own miss. Nine rebounds already for Okafor, who's averaging 11 per game. Talik Brown, bullet pass inside Okafor. Made up for it. Solid play by Talik Brown. Tenth turnover for the Cardinals, and Okafor with the rejection at the buzzer. 71 more blocked shots this season than their opponent. And inside, Okafor gets an easy two. So Eccles with a season high. Okafor runs the floor and gets it back. They are 14th in the country, number one in the Big East in scoring. Okafor down low, Eccles held him, didn't matter. I would think clearly would drop back below UConn in the new pole. It would seem so. Okafor gets inside, Bennett. 
Cardinals not coming off nearly as long a layoff. The Cardinals playing at home on Tuesday night. Howland. Spectacular as well. And there's part of the sound. Rebound, Shimon Tools. Gordon, left side, Denim Brown. Oh, here's Okafor inside, and the foul. Seats about 5,500. Every seat should be full tonight. Okafor working on Harrison, and UConn's on the board first. Bounce pass from a 6'10 to another 6'10. Okafor throwing it down. Villanueva finds Gordon, a three on one. Okafor. Four back in the game. Working on three outs and scoring. Connecticut on a 7 nothing run. 9 nothing run. Most of the time he'll knock him down. Half of his makes and attempts on the year from three, but then there's the answer. Just like Okafor really reads the ball well while in flight as a rebounder. Okafor hits the short jumper, and it's a 13-point edge. Shoulder. Oh, oh, nice strip by McCree, but what a play by Okafor. Dave, in this, in this crazy little gym that seats about 5,700, the longer Rice stays within reach. Oh, my goodness. What a pass by Villanueva to Okafor. Two-point dunk turn into six or eight points. Don't get your head down. What another feed from Villanueva <laughs> to Okafor. Very few teams in the country have versatile big guys that can go out and defend passers and catchers. I'm talking about Villanueva and Okafor. Difference right on your team. Connecticut's got a handful. They got three and then uh, fill around with guys who understand the role. Look out. Again, he elevates off the floor as quick as anyone I've seen on the college level in a long time for a big guy. I mean, catch, boom, up and in. Catch, boom, up and in. Great. They can't let Okafor drive down the lane like that. UConn, the number one scoring team in the Big East. Oh, Okafor! That's, that's what I'm talking about right there. Uh, reading some of the articles in the paper this, this morning and afternoon, Jim Calhoun always concerned about coming into this building. High off the glass from the fundamental school. There they go again. Look Turn it the... over. Marcus Williams, tip by Okafor. Well done. They didn't really look for it, so clearly they're looking to take the time off the clock. Gordon wanted that one, didn't he? Penetrate and get a nice flush from Okafor by four. Uh, clearly when you take a guy on the... Out of the starting lineup, it takes some pressure off him. Okafor, no. Charlie Villanueva, no. Put back Okafor and score it. He's used to muscling people. Jump hook. Denied. They got numbers. Denim Brown, hard to the goal. Shot it short, but Okafor cleans it up. Initially. Joel Wagon sets up Shields. Got deep. Oh, baby. Oh, don't even think about it. He's on top of the top shelf. Here he comes. There's again. another one. Oh, man. Four for Okafor. Okafor gets the loose ball. Denim Brown is there. Back to Okafor. Layup. Count it. And he'll go to the line. Huskies on the run. Marcus Williams. This little stutter step. Good cut inside. Reverse no. Put back Okafor. Dave Sims and Jim Spinarco with you at the rack of Piscataway. And Okafor, the All-American, gives Connecticut its first lead since 25-23. Four fouls. Keeps alive, penetrates, he wanted it, went for it, didn't get it, Okafor puts it up, blew the bunny. Okafor again, no doubt about that one, tied at 63. Wow. Amazana going it against Okafor. Oh, oh, look at that defensive baby. play. That is an All-American Player of the Year demonstration right there by Emeka Okafor. And to avoid the foul also on his sixth block, a big one right there to establish defensively. From the Mr. Russell School of Defense. Don't even think about bringing it in here. Connecticut leads by three. Now Denim Brown to the 33. Finds Boone, the freshman. That's a nice dish to Okafor, yes. And he's in the corner now and has the ball. There's the entry pass to Okafor. Turn around jumper, got it. 6-0 run for UConn. They're up by four. Beautiful crossover dribble. Oh, Gilbert's two in a row that he's missed. And the other end, Okafor. They'll make you pay. Five, four for 20 now shooting for Oklahoma in the ball game. Oh, there's the block. They'll be a little bit more patient. No chance. Taking nothing away from Georgia Tech. But let's put that game in perspective. Here's Okafor again. Beautiful. Tremendous leadership and ability. There's points. There's another great pass. This time by Williams. 
I think of the great Muggsy Bogues when he was in college. He used to be so effective. Over the course of his career, Brown has averaged eight points per game. He's down around five this season. There's a little soft jumper. It's good. Lavender with 11 points now as he hit that three. Boone and uh, Denim Brown getting ready to go back on the floor for UConn. Uh, Under eight. Controlled by Talik Brown. Push ahead. Okafor and the foul. How about that pass? Again, right off the dribble with the one hand. Terrific delivery by Talik Brown. That's the fourth time today that Connecticut has come up with a beautiful assist off the dribble, one hand pass. That had a little force to yes, it, it really did. A nice concentration by Okafor there, even knowing he's going to get fouled. Goes up strong in Big 12. Rejected by Okafor. And there we see Okafor right on the inside. Jabari Brown, who can elevate as well. Rebound, Faust for the Sooners. Loose ball. Put it away. Okafor. Right, gently laid it in. With the stop and finish. Denim Brown is now, oh, he finally misses a shot. Rebound Okafor, who leads the Big East in that category. But he makes frequent substitutions. Talik Brown gets it right back off the inbound. And there's Okafor with no one on him. Talik Brown gives to Gordon for the penetration. Down low to Okafor. They had 27 assists on 34 field goals against Oklahoma. You add up UConn's two runs tonight, 15-0 and 11-0. Those two alone have outscored Georgetown. Down low, Okafor. Great balance. Had it even know where the rim was. Conference's player of the week, rookie of the week. We'll check the out-of-town scoreboard and the first half highlights from this one. Omeka Okafor adding to those highlights. In the middle gets it to Bowman. Hesitation on the dribble, and Okafor caught up for the block. Denim Brown, low block, Okafor shoots over Freeman. Now checking in in double figures for the Hoyas. Sixth time he's done that this year. Go to the Huskies. Down low, Okafor catch and shoot over Freeman. Shoot some threes with effectiveness. They don't have that dominant inside presence. Talik Brown misses the runner. Okafor gets the rebound and adds to his toe. Ben Gordon, wide open three. Okafor tips it in. Oh, it is a foul. Yupon oh, awfully tough here. The tough at the Civic Center as well, though. Oh, check it out. Okafor gives it to Lee Brown. Three on two. Gordon, right side pull up. Okafor with his 11th rebound, and he has just tied his career high with 27 points. Into the hands of Talik Brown. Underneath Okafor is a quick put up. And there you saw how quickly May was able to go ahead and execute the play. Gets ah. the back door cut and loses it. How about that return pass? This really is uh, only the third road trip of the season for this UConn team. There's a pass to Okafor. May's playing 28 minutes a game. Okafor, beauty. Strong off the glass, not there. Byron Sanders rejected. <laughs> Okafor bodying up on May. Can May handle him? Not this time. He's showing now that the guy that you would expect to see, almost an all-conference type player. Okafor, nice, soft jump. Nice pass. Boy, it was terrific, wasn't it? Noel goes for the steal. There's Okafor. Turn around again. Beauty. Now he fronts Okafor. They can't get the ball into him. There it is. Yep, now that's a mismatch. Gordon, entry pass. Okafor, got it. Timeout, North Carolina. They've got to get a bigger man in the ball game. Now, one of the good things about Williams right now is that Okafor has to go out and play him on the perimeter. But here's where there's a big disadvantage. Okafor just too big for him inside. 9.23 to go. Oh, brother! Let's take another look at the block. We're talking about against anybody else in college basketball. Manuel has himself maybe a dunk, much less a layup. Okafor just negated it completely. May back into the ball game. He was going for a dunk, and Okafor just goes way up. Perfect timing. Every pass off the pick and roll. Okafor turn around, not there. Noel and Boone fight for it. Okafor picks up the loose ball. 1.40 to go. UConn leading by one. There's Okafor. 
with Williams muscling him. Had a double-double against Rutgers over the weekend. Troutman denied inside by Okafor and Boone. That's where he's really good, Troutman, getting that low block in a hurry. Okafor with a block. He averages five per game. I know he's got to be aggressive. Give it to him. Jump hook. Okafor. Taft tried to block it, but a little bit too late, and he scored over Troutman. Two straight turnovers by Page on two possessions, which he was trying to feed Morris. Good catch by Okafor. Okafor trying to take advantage of the smaller Troutman. I'll tell you, Troutman rode him out. He reset and just can take a hit and make that shot. Okafor again, ridden out. Look at that, doesn't matter. They do that as well as anybody. Post defense. 10 to shoot. Good job by Krauser to go underneath. Talik Brown. Okafor, the flop. Send it in, big fella. 3.24 to go. A great one in the Big East. It's Connecticut leading Pittsburgh 62-61. High screen by Taft. Krauser goes quickly to the bucket. Okafor rejected it and swatted it right to Talik Brown. Nobody on the board for the Friars. Down low to Okafor with the left hand. Uh, in stores last year, Boston College just came in and kicked them all over the place. They just never got going. Who can't finish? In the middle, Okafor with a beautiful move. Dalvin. <laughs> Boy, he was only six for 24 before that shot, but he shot it with confidence. Oh. Down low they go to. Oh. And a reject oh. Oh. of Okafor. And he gets the loose ball, though, and Emeka Okafor now with 11 points. Gets his third personal foul, so he has a difficulty now with 16 27 to go. Here's Okafor. Well executed in by play by the Huskies. And Brown launches, can't get it to go. Josh Boone puts it back up. And cleaning it all up is Okafer. I think you can attribute that to Okafer. Beautiful inside move by Okafer. They get it down low to him now, and Okafer goes up and under and gets it down. And Okafer running the floor. Oh, exclamation Okafer. point. Took it right at him. Quickly, Ben Gordon to Okafor, who runs the floor and gets a dunk at the other end. His, he felt his transition defense is the greatest weakness for Virginia Tech. There's Okafor with his first block shot of the evening. Dangerous pass. Matthew somehow caught it. A couple of head fakes, and then Okafor with his second block of the night. Both teams had more turnovers than assists in the first half. It wasn't a pretty half. Counted in the foul. And you usually don't see big men that young who like it physical. They've got to grow into that. Another turnover for the Hokies. They're 11th of the night. Down low, Okafor. Providence Six. had a lot to do with that. I mean, they really played well. Pretty good strategy pulling Okafor out. Nice pass. Connecticut gets up the floor quickly, and Okafor there to clean up the mess to tie the game at two. Agby. Blocked by Okafor. Marshall. Missed the three. Dornikamp, another block for Okafor. And makes some perimeter shots. They're doing all of those things in the first half. Okafor in the lane. His second field goal. They're loving it here at Boston College. Okafor somehow got through two BC players without traveling to cut the BC lead to four. Where did he come from, Dave? Right over Villanueva. Okafor. And he'll go to the line to try to complete the three-point play. Midway through the first half. Take your pick on the block wow. there. Okafor, <laughs> Denham Brown. Okafor on the other end for Connecticut. Wow, that's amazing. But you're right, Ron. BC can't rely on its big guys to keep hitting jump shots to win. As Okafor schools Dornikamp. Connecticut won here last year by 37. This year, it's even with four minutes to play. Okafor, strong move over Agby and Smith. That's an example of a young guy taking advantage of staying in school. Okafor right in the middle of that zone, knocks down the 15-footer. Along with Okafor, Villanueva, there's Rashad Anderson. Nice dunk down to 
Okafor. Warren trying to back down Okafor, the best shot blocker in the country, uh, he's and he got him his third of the game. He has become a superstar. I may have to change my. See, this is midseason. Postseason is what counts. <laughs> Okafor knocks one down. It's so documented, so long and lean. They try to play passing lanes. Okafor, the 10 footer. Brown, the rebound. Gordon kicks it out. Talik Brown. Villanueva, no, partially blocked. Okafor oh, is strong enough to get it down. Slide into that open area. Okafor, the turnaround. Nice job of breaking the zone. I like Villanueva. I'm telling you, he's a great young player. Okafor from Talik Brown. They sit in that zone. He's getting a gap. Trying to get to the loop. Get right to the box inside. I was going to say, get right to the box inside. Connecticut's Ooh. lost three games, but when they play at their best... Mike Bray's a heck of a coach, so they can get hot. Nice play. Wow. There it is. Little two-man game. Go right down the gut. Make one guy in the middle. Up the play, too. Gordon spins. Has his shot partially blocked. Open for there to clean up. Rashad Anderson picked Beeline's pocket. Two on two with Talik Brown. Rebound, Okafor beat Fisher down the floor. Rebound in the lane, Villanueva. Then look at the nifty feed to Okafor. How did he squeeze that one in? 29 from behind the arc. Nice touch from Villanueva to Okafor. Well, he's third in the depth chart at point guard, by the way. There's Okafor with the block shot. Sally is really hanging in there trying again. Inbound to Villanueva. Oh, great. Look at the dish and the foul. Give you an idea of the incredible depth of talent on this Husky team. They have four guys who have 25 point games, and there's one of them over for. He's got 13 today. Well, that's a little respect. Everyone running back to transition defensively. Okafor spins in the lane. He's got 15. <laughs> he beat me once, not this time. Gordon. Down low to Okafor. He's double teamed. It doesn't matter. He's in check until the end of the game. Oh, no, they stayed in that game for about 30 minutes. Fisher rejected by Okafor. We used to play against Derek Coleman, who could block shots as well as Okafor. And we used to say that your complexion was really bad after the game if you had to pick the rubber out of your face. And there's the double double for Okafor. And there's two more points and a foul. Picked his pocket from the weak side. Ahead, Gordon. Oh, Okafor. How did he catch that? And now Talik Brown, like any competitor, is going to take advantage of it. He gives to Okafor in the lane. He lays it in. Francis was a question mark right up until game time. He's trying to give it a go at back spasm throughout the weekend. Okafor scores over Francis. More than anybody in the country at those difficult angle shots. Woo! Get it out. Thomas has a great demeanor right now. Just has a great look to him. Okafor, he wanted that. He set up down on the low block that entire possession, trying to seal off Timmerman. Because he can shoot that ball. Francis had it deflected by Okafor. Thomas Pretty. to Rick Cornett, blocked by Okafor. Yeah, Anderson shot that under pressure. Yeah. Okafor, drought without a field goal for Notre Dame. They went the last 6-19 of the first half. Rather than allow Okafor to get that easy one. The only thing, Jay, is he can score around the rim. A little pressure on the ball, pressure on the passer wouldn't have hurt either. Okafor. Wow. Right back to Okafor. And that's the silencer. Defined than he was last year, although still some work to be done in the way for this. Chris. Gordon's got to move. He's letting Quinn just stand there. Okafor over Rick Cornett. Thought he was fouled, didn't get a call. A three ball would tie it for the Huskies. Instead, it's Okafor for two. It's Ben Gordon with the ball with Talik Brown. Okafor, Moon in. In low to Okafor. And one. Misfiring, but Okafor is there. Krauser stayed with it. Well done. That's what he does really well. Get into the three second area. Okafor runs the floor. That's why he will be perhaps the first player drafted by the NBA. There's a double up as soon as he gets the ball. Okafor wrap around. Nice play by Brown. One of the most underrated players in the Big East. Left hand from Okafor. There's the same screen. Troutman. Krauser picked up. Keeps coming. Blocked Okafor. Left hand is your guide hand. That could be bothering him. You don't want to foul here now. You don't want to foul to stop the clock. Talik Brown comes away. And here come the Huskies. Okafor. Hardest job. Got to give somebody a step here. 
job makes it more difficult for them to score. Hamilton is a guy who just knocks around around the goal, but not a good offensive player. Down low, Okafor backs in on the shorter Zhao and hooks over. Head fake, then finds Villanueva even lower. Omeka Okafor with the putback. Okafor backs his way in, spins, and Okafor got it on the way up. Pittsburgh needed a Carl Krauser end-to-end -end rush to keep that game going. Okafor with the basket and the foul. Wisconsin with the early lead at Illinois in the Big Ten. And Kansas trailing Baylor. In the Big East, St. John's up four at the half. Red Storm have not won a game in the conference. And Villanova with a 10-point lead of Virginia Tech. The Leak Brown to Okafor puts it on the floor, hits the runner. Out to Leak Brown, high pick and roll, cut off. Thomas slips, baseline, jump hook is good for Okafor. They beat the Orangemen on the road 84 to 72. Cornette rejected by Okafor. Okafor with eight rebounds already, and he knocks down the jump shot in the paint. Some of that in order to keep close. They've been pounded on the board, but you can sometimes overcome that, Gus. They don't throw it to the foul line at their end. They throw it to half court, and if you're not back, the next pass is at the rim. Okafor on the baseline. Jameer Nelson from St. Joe's. Cornette stripped by Okafor. Out of bounds, and it goes off of his knee. Before this recent stretch of poor free throw shooting in the last few games. Okafor rebound, rips it down, and draws the foul. With four turnovers today. Only four. Connecticut has turned it over 12 times. Okafor again. Jones hard down the lane. Loses his body. Rejected. On the second half, Thomas Craig did the basket. And somehow, Okafor closes and swats it out of bounds. Bill, a little bit too much showtime. Here is Anderson running the floor. Lays it up with the left hand and knocked down by Okafor. Here is Hill. Hearing it from the crowd with the crit. Uh, Tricky crossover dribbles, but then a wild shot. And here's Okafor running the floor for the easy dunk. Nice look inside. Okafor uses the glass. Yell of anguish as he went to the floor after the contact. Gordon got away with carrying the basketball. Rashad Anderson inside misses. Okafor there with the putback. Len, you know, St. John's they know is a New York City school. As Okafor gets the nice feed from Gordon of the spectrum of what the situation is here with St. John's. Okafor with a nice feed again, able to finish inside. Here is Talik Brown with a floater, no good, stepped up and in. There he is, he's a factor. He has an excuse anymore. Amen. Okafor rises up and knocks it down. Is Villanova's formula today. Inside Frazier with those three fouls, had to be careful. And Okafor with a left-hand finish. Okafor with a jump hook. Yeah. No doubt about that, and they have Shimon tools in the game for defensive purposes. Here is Boy. Boy all the way to the basket. It is blocked by Okafor. They'll get it up and would have counted. Oh, oh my goodness. Wow. And it was a 40-38 advantage for Connecticut two minutes into the second half, and that's when Villanova took over. Inside Okafor, got position, counted, and closures will be done. This is a 6-11 to a 6-11. Notice how Boone keeps the ball up, throws a high pass near the corner of the backboard. Nothing can be done when Okafor gets it that close. The dilemma is do you front? Frazier tries to, but unable. And as a result, Okafor gets a slam bam. Thank you, ma'am. At the end of regulation, Bob, they took it right at Okafor, and that's when he got his first block of the ball game. Let's see what the strategy is here. Sumter able to get it to Boy. Under one second. Oh. Let's see as the light goes, the hole goes is there a foul. Foy has predicted, took the ball strong to the basket. Okafer, all basketball. Terrific, terrific block right here. Foy thinks he's got it. Wow, what a game. Was there body? Yes, there was body, but oh, as you mentioned, they let a lot go in this game with the physical side of the game, and Okafor comes up big time for the Huskies. He had only two blocks in the game. He forced overtime with his block at the end of regulation, and he ends it with the block at the end of overtime. The Huskies come in having won four in a row, including an overtime victory at Villanova.
Boone, Anderson, Okafor, Gordon, and Brown. Oh, goodness. Too easy, Jay, huh? Excuse me, Sean. That 2 3 zone, they picked it apart. They're very well coached. I mean, they're a confident team, too. Okafor with the right hand. The one handed shot. He has five points. Give it to him. There you go. Okafor over Frey. <sighs> They come with Copeland, just a little too small, and it goes away from him. He is putting the show on right now. Magic down here against Okafor. Look at this. Look at that. That's unbelievable. He gets the space. The box set. Cross screen to get Okafor in the low block. Soft, huh? By Okafor, who runs the court. Opens it up for Villanueva. That is a great play. There's that free mind you alluded to. How about that? Free mind, free will, and the ability to be effective. He came out of the overtime game against Villanova a couple of times with the sore back over the weekend. Villanueva, up to four. Teams that got nine top 50 wins. Texas in good shape. Look at this easy shot. Soft. Brown gives him the ball. And they keep him away. Now, Okafor using a little body here and yet moving the feet. Whitney blocked by Villanueva. Then Okafor came to block the follow-up drive. And Chris, he wears number 12, Richie Regan, the old athletic director, and great All-American in the 50s. Oh. How about that? Oh, oh, oh. The angle, huh? Are you kidding me? Is that straight? I and thought the back was sore, Jay. And to think his back was hurting. Great angle, but look at the quickness and explosiveness getting off the floor with such authority. When he fouled Okafor a moment ago. They go right into Okafor again. Created fatigue, and you wouldn't know it the last two games. Saturday against Georgetown, he had 25 points. Okafor is third block, the ninth of the night for the Huskies. And the pace as they whip it around. Warren, Okafor tries for the block. So far, unlike uh, Pittsburgh, and there's the first time we've oh. seen it today. The number one seed in East Rutherford, number one seed in Phoenix, on and on. St. Louis and Atlanta. Crowd getting into it. Syracuse playing extremely well right now. Up seven, looking for more. There's a rejection by Okafor. Troutman, good position inside. He's got two Huskies to deal with, and Okafor just blocked his shot. For the fans, and then Brandon Knight, that would have been absolutely astonishing if he had made that shot because he couldn't walk. Here's Okafor. He looks pretty good early. Okafor now being bodied by Taft down to the block. Jumper. He looks pretty good, doesn't he? Browser, let's see if Pittsburgh can get on track. Troutman. Guess who took it away? Okafor. Pittsburgh trying to defend its tournament title. That hasn't been done since UConn won it two years in a row back in the late 90s. Those are the players that are confidence builders and, a, and a momentum builders. Connecticut trying to find out how healthy Okafor is and win the title themselves. Okafor looks pretty good. That's block number three. High screen by Okafor. Gordon the pull up from the wing. Three opportunities for the Huskies and Okafor lays it in. Things that got to go through him on every trip, I think, Byrne. Sheptic pumps, Okafor goes up. Sheptic again, and he forgot that was Okafor. In the early going from outside the arc. Okafor yet to score. There's the answer to that. No scoring in this half thus far. Underneath, Okafor. Say good night. Say good night. That team, you got to meet him. See how they run that clear for him? A little dancing in the step back. Okafor with the touch. And then the second foot back. What it means to them to have such roots in the state of Vermont. Uh, he is home. He's not leaving from the field tonight. Okafor underneath. Hello. Oh. What are you have for dinner? <laughs> Okafor is there to put it back. There comes the help from Mahea and almost a triple team. How about that? Yeah. Yeah. Jeez, what a big fella. He has developed touch for Denim Brown to Lee Brown off the glass. Okafor with the putback. Nice rearrangement, huh? They needed Gordon to step up, and he did to the team of 81 points. And there is the 431st block. So does Brown, who's played very well, had a good first hit. What a catch on that tough delivery. How about the back now? 
You got Drake Diener back, which is a wonderful start. So you got your shooting guard. And of course, Emeka, everybody feels will not be back. He and Oakford on the all conference team. Talik Brown, all time leader in assists in Connecticut history. Inside Okafer, didn't take him long to find the All America. Anderson into the post to Okafer. He likes that 10 footer and makes it. Two for two is Okafer. At the defensive end, a little extra hard. Corey Smith finally for Vanderbilt hits the three and it's 25 to 11 and Okafer quickly to end to end to get two of those back. Armstrong feeds Okafer a fine left handed hook. Tied it four early. Davidson tries to get inside. Okafer returns the favor. And another block, this time by Boone. He's gentle Ben in a lot of ways. He's lived up to that nickname. Davis, Okafer with a block, his second. And another! Took it right off the rim as Evan Brock appeared to have an easy two. Talik loses the handle. Petway, Shelton, another block. Oh my! <laughs> Emeka Okafer, who leads the nation 138 blocks. Hey, Alabama, Crimson Tide, meet Emeka Okafer. Yes, he has been beaten once or twice early in his first half defensively, but you keep attacking the big man, he is going to make you pay. He is guarding that basket with a vengeance. Trying to guard Ben uh, Gordon. Oh, what a leap by Okafer. He scores, and he'll go to the line. Against Syracuse, Davis takes it inside against Oakford. Uh oh, that's five blocks for the All America. Is ready. Gives it up. Dang. Well, again, respecting Oakford so much. There's another foul on him, however. Is that going to be a Mecca? It is. Wow, that's the story here in the first four minutes. Two on a Mecca Okafor. And Jim Calhoun very upset over there. He probably is going to have to make a change early. And this is what we talked about. The key to this game, Williams and Okafor. Okafor can't believe it's his foul. Boy, he he's going to have to sit. He better be careful. He is just furious at this call. And there you see the body contact that he made. Legitimate foul. But Okafor is going to have to sit down. And they're going to have to bring in Villanueva. Remember, we're going to see a Mecca Okafor come back on the floor. Essentially a 20-minute game for him. No factor with those two fouls picked up so early in the first half. No surprise. Reddick drills them both. To Okafor, his first two of the night. Big overplay that time by two. Get him down. Okafor stacks it. Bucks it. No difference when he's on the floor in it, I'd say. Building the way to show the first half. He can get some things done. Put back up by Okafor. <laughs> Dang. Oh, what a block by Okafor. Huge. Oh. He wants it at the other end. Turn around jumper. Yeah. Coming on, and that's eight unanswered for the Huskies. Okafer with the block and the basket, nine points all in this half. We got a one point game. Okafer challenging the man behind him with four fouls. Left hand, yes, yeah, soft touch. Well, if you're Connecticut, why not keep going there? Drives the right side, Gordon. Drops to that side to the man you asked for. Open for a turnaround shot. Got it. Back away. That was a game. They've scored the last seven points. Brown on the drive. Give up Okafer. Shot for the lead. And rattles off. Tipped around by Boone. Back to Okafer. All right, thank you. I'm telling you, it's almost like they can't believe it. A mech. I've never seen a guy. For three or four minutes here, you just can't believe how this game finished. Tell me about it. You know, I had a frustrating first half. Um, you know, I, I wasn't even I wasn't even in there. You know, and I was just I just I just my teammates told me keep, keep myself in the game, make sure my head was in it, and they just kept they just told me and that you know second half is going to be a time to dominate, help us out. Came in the second half, I was, the team rallied, we, we, we played hard, came out with the win. At the top of the key, you mentioned the 10 out of 30 in the first matchup, won by Georgia Tech by 16. Also only made one out of 10 from three. They've already hit one already in the first minute here. And Okafer with his first points. 
Little matchup zone action. Villanueva has come in with three seconds on the shot clock and the dunk. Boy, oh, that'll put it away. That's an easy way to beat the shot clock. Okay for turnaround, easy two. Plus that wild shot, definitely influenced by the presence of Emeka at the other end, yes. Connecticut's game, nice turnaround jumper, nothing there. A liner, but McHenry has his knocked away. Quickly down, and Okafer, yes, this time. No, I think that Okafer is far superior to Shemsu at this point in his career. So again, a look at that right there. <laughs> example, that's on the second ground. Taken out of his arms this time. Muhammad and Okafer takes it right out of there with the swap. Gordon Jumper he knows he's got Okafer there to retrieve it. Oh, yes. oh, and he puts it up with the left hand. <laughs> what they'll do. And Brown. Mecca. One and a half remaining, 17 point comfortable margin. It has been all second half long. The jumper, Okafer again. You're going to try to get back in this because you got to figure Connecticut would make some of the fouls. Now with 10 on the shot clock, Okafer makes his move and gets the hoop. Let's see if we can uh, get a Mecca over here. He's taping the whole thing. A Mecca. You've won the national championship. What do you have to say about this moment and to those fans up there and to the rest of the team? Man, it's hard to put in words. Uh, you know, we couldn't have done without our fans, couldn't have done without our teammates. You know, it was a great effort. It was a great season. You know, we had our ups and downs, but this moment makes it all worthwhile. You know, for 2004, we're national champions. You know, that's all of us, it's together. I'm not gonna jam it. Did you ever think that you weren't gonna get there Saturday? I mean, a little bit of doubt crept in my mind, but you know, I knew if I doubted, that's when we were going to lose. So I just put up those negative thoughts and just kept hope alive. And we came out, snuck by Duke, and came out and you know, grabbed the national title. Congratulations. All right, congratulations, Ben, Rashad, and all the Huskies, both old and new, the national champions here.